Finds that it's, it's almost like oh, a little life raft for different people. If you're gonna, you know, yeah. here that's it why is. I say it's both. Oh, that's okay if it's ever. I mean, obviously, we have to humble Heather, ourselves and turn towards him. But if he wasn't pursuing any of us, none of us would turn to him. None of us would repent if he wasn't. If it hey, wasn't for his grace. To, to <coughs> why did they openly what he did? And what Pastor John said today, I think that we don't realize what that victory really means. We don't really live in it. So I think that acknowledging that fact, that right there, I mean, that was a huge him seeking us out first because while we were the sinners, he died for us. And that's how he showed his love to us. But I still feel that afterwards, because we are all rock, and his his part, his, the role that he plays is, is constant. It is faithful more than we can even define the word. Patient and graceful more than we can define it either. But there's he doesn't tie a rope to us. No. And yanks us closer. It is a humility that allows us to come to. to but it's just him. like the sheep that he, you know that he carries around his neck too, drawing them close to him. Right, and it's his, well, it's his, it is his dealing with us as sons that helps us get home. Right? Because, the chastising. Yes. Yeah. yeah, it's him yeah. and it's the what he does that humbles us so we would never humble ourselves. That's right. Well, I think that's that that's ourselves. the initial. I think that was the initial. I just think we have to be careful not to give ourselves too much credit yeah. Yeah. of our relationship with the Lord. It's I'm all his person. It's all that's what we do. We do have a responsibility in it, but we certainly can't take any credit of it. And that's what I've seen. Where I've seen people twist it the other way. The home I grew up in, now I'm yeah, self-righteous like because I do go to church and I do read my Bible and I do pray. So now I'm self-righteous because it's on my own merit. It's just like the Pharisees. Well, no, no, but that, you're we talking, but you're talking righteousness right there. That's more dealing with righteousness. And I think that what what, our, what I'm trying to say with the pursuing is is not um, to make us righteous. It's to keep that relationship. Well, it's that, but it's that it's that relationship though that builds the righteousness. Right. Yeah. But yeah, I mean that's that's actually absolutely the truth. But like I see, I just have seen it in my own family where they take the pursuit of God and, and it's all the do's and don't list, and that's.